ish. Um, my name is Ashlea Anya, and I am the creator and writer on the show From Home. And this is Woo! some of our amazing cast. Woo -woo! But I'm Yoram. I play Olivia. She's neurotic, spastic like me, so it was very easy to relate to her. Charlie from HR said, you don't work here anymore, Miracle. You shouldn't even be here. I also, I also gave her I kind of a back. I knocked over something on cue. I just feel like that was perfect, like, stage direction. She was like, neurotic and spastic. Cue, knock over cup. Yeah. Here's another surprise from the show. Let's, let's just do this real quick. Do, 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 do. Boom! There he is. <laughs> I know. It looks like we're in two different environments, but we're not. It's movie magic. Magic, 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 magic. He's going to have to slide over to my tile. What's up, everybody? Uh, my name's Jasper, and I play David Katrina. Now, let's stop messing around and get to the meat. And the only way to eat meat is to hunt it and kill it yourself. Why aren't you writing this down? Um, this dude is just crazy. It's so much fun trying to see the things that he's going to come up with to do the next time. I had a cast once. I broke my arm in an arm wrestling match with my father. I was five. That day I became a man. Um, it's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I figured what, you know, this is a great time. What other time should I, I go other than uh, after... After David Katrina, <laughs> Jeannie, you're you're our boss, Jeannie. I need and I'm you Jeannie's to, uh, boss. Enough of that. Thank you. No, you are not, Katrina. <laughs> okay, we'll find out. <laughs> so, Correct. Uh, <laughs> my arch nemesis. But hey, everyone. My name is Gigi, and I play Jeannie on From Home. And uh, much like Jeannie, I am. I use a lot of hand gesticulation. Let's send happy sales hands to George. No, please don't. Y'all don't do that. Very enthusiastic. It's sales training day. It's no fun when the rabbit has the gun. Get it? Really? <laughs> no one? Jeannie, it's a quote from training day. Booyah! It's a quote from Training Day. <laughs> um, I'm very bubbly. Uh, I will say this, Jeannie, she tries really hard. She, yeah. you know, is very passionate and dedicated, but she uh, just is not that competent. And I am the complete opposite. I get the job done. So that's the difference between me and Jeannie. We like to get people together and, you know, um, you know, just have a, a good time, good meetings. But yeah, poor Jeannie. Poor Jeannie. She tries, though. She tries. She really does. She she be trying, but Lord, the struggle. Ooh. So I'll go. Um, yeah. I am Shannon Davis. I play the role of Charlene. Jeannie, I'm not here to say hello. I'm here because your team has 53 compliance violations. And why would you hire another employee? You only made $800 last month. <laughs> this character is similar to me because I'm kind of snarked, like real like short with people sometimes, um, even in my professional life, which is bad. We have literally like 17 days left, Charlene. Oh my goodness. Hope is lost. Jeannie. Give it up. Olivia got a $10,000 fine 10 seconds ago. My bad guys. I really thought the call was one of our clients. You gave a random man our client's social security number. Like, why would you do that? <laughs> I'm kind of steak and potatoes, a numbers girl. So I needed, like, don't give me the fluff. I don't care about how chipper. I just want the information and the numbers. And that's kind of me in real life. <laughs> um, aside from that, it has been a joy to play from home. It reminds me of my current situation from work from home where we have a ton of uh, WebEx and Zoom meetings and things like that. So this is real reality. So you have every bits and pieces of these characters in real life. So I enjoy the show. <laughs> yeah, that makes me happy. Hey, y'all. He's trying to be all nice petting y'all's dog. Right. <laughs> He's trying to show <laughs> like his pet. sensitive side. Right, that part. <laughs> Look. 
Y'all stop being a hater. Love me. <laughs> For all of me and my <laughs> essence. Um, but hey, this is uh, Drew, a.k.a. George. Always the best at everything that he does, including working in this call center. How can we afford this? Pretty sure we made like $800 last month. Right. And $700 of that was me. Show off much? Yeah, George. Relax, buddy. I mean, man, I'm, I'm just saying. Uh, okay, matter of fact, <clears throat> Tamisha, how much of that did you say? <laughs> uh, human resources and uh, the wannabe manager, the a-hole, David Katrina, they don't want to give me my props. But they know. They don't. They know the company would not survive without me. <laughs> oh my God, George, like, I just need you to just get it under control. What is happening? George? Listen, first of all, you know I'm at work. Okay. Why can't you get them under control? Why did you forget the iPad charger? It's your weekend. You should have an iPad charger. And you should be able to do I'm at work. Look, how you expect to get your money? From you. <gasps> okay. Why don't you just go back to dancing? <laughs> the minute the minute that I decided to quit, yeah, with your two percent sales. The company will fold and they will both lose their jobs immediately. I feel like we're not watching the same show. The owners, the look. That's not the lead, Drew. Huh? <laughs> You're not the lead. Right. You're really not. Like, I just don't understand. Like, how many lines do you think you have? Like, that's the part I'm You're trying not to figure out. hero. <laughs> I cannot. I'm saying, at, look, as the owners of the company, who the, who the real superstar of our fabulous company is. And they'd be like, who? Right. Yeah, it's, 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 it's not Charlene. It's not David Katrina. It's not Jeannie. It's not. They literally it's not Olivia. They literally sent David Katrina to save the day. <laughs> like they literally sent David Katrina. Yeah, I think they know him by name. Like I feel like they know who he is. They don't know who you are. The only reason, <laughs> the only reason they hired David Katrina is because I turned down that job. He's not because what? I, He's not was it even it. offered to I'm you? Not, what look, script was this on? Was this like on a non draft like a rough draft somewhere? No, it's not. It's not. Really not. It's I a lost really, episode. No, I felt like I would make more money in the position that I was in. I, I they told me what they were paying David Katrina, and I was like, what? No, I don't want that. So that I mean, no, no offense, no offense, David Katrina. I'm just saying. I just didn't want your job. I mean, hey. Yeah, he traded his whole world Look. in his head. Good job. Yay. Right. Like, I, I was going to say. Wow. Like playing a part and complete <laughs> utter fantasy. Imagination <laughs> is a hell of a drug. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Oh, my God. Um, well, listen. Oh, I didn't even talk about Ari. Let me see. Um, I feel like Ari is a lot like me because Ari is the person who, like, be scheming in the background at the company. Like, they know what they're doing. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be in charge here. We're, we're not, not voting. You know, it's decided. I'm the manager now. Okay. No. So I'm sorry that it came out contesting. this way. You can't contest anything. You're barely holding on to your job as it is. <laughs> like, I, I feel like I don't always have fun at work, which I think is very similar to Ari. Like, everybody else is, like, having fun and joking with Miracle. And Ari's like, I'm just not going to show up to work today because y'all have nothing under control. Like, I'm, I think I was a lot worse about that when I was younger, like, in my 20s about, like, if people were, like, playing at work or, you know, the activities they would have, like, oh, tell us three things you did this weekend for the Monday meeting. I'd be like, we have no time for this. Like, I don't care what this person did this weekend. I don't want to hear about Donna's third match.com date that failed. Like, I don't want to hear about that at all. I don't want to hear about Susan's kittens. That's getting gross at this point.